because the shed's going to come down, but we don't want to take the shed down right now. What's wrong with the shed? It looks nice. It's a dry rot. I don't think nothing dry about it. It's a bit wet rot. What do you reckon, John? Wet rot or dry rot? Combination of both. Yeah, damp rot. Or it could be something to do with moist joints. I don't moist. think we can use uh, that, that word on YouTube, John. What, moist? Moist or damp? Any of those words. No? Any particular reason why we can't? Yeah. Give us some comments whether we're allowed to use moist, damp or joist. Um, See, is this bit of wood wet, moist or, or damp? damp? And what's the difference? Good. It's not ringing wet. It's not. Oh, hang on a no. minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on, John. Oh, look. look, we have. That's moist. Oh. That's moist. Yeah. That's not damp. That's not wet. That's moist. So this is going downhill very, very quickly. Normal service will be resumed fairly soon. Change of plan. Okay. So De if you deviation draw... or debate? There's no debate over it. I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. It's not my house. Let's have a change. Debate's of plan. different. Yeah, that's a different thing. So are we debating now, or are we? No, I'm just telling you. No, you're, you're, you're listening to what John's saying. Yeah. Okay. There's no debate. There's no debate. We already had a conversation about you're going to take that down. We're going to put the new summer ice in. Yep. That's... We then had a conversation about from the toilet in the back corner. Don't tell the planners. A receptacle for wastewater in the, in the yeah, far yeah, corner. Yeah, yeah. But I'm actually thinking not in the far corner. What are you thinking? Because that would be a door opening into the inside, taking up inside space. Okay. Single double glazed door could go on the end on the outside. Yeah. We could frost over the thing so people aren't just sitting there si getting with well, the wastewater. Yeah. Yeah. And then it can not take up space on the inside, storage room access from the inside, which isn't going to take up any room. Yeah. Is at the front, you're outside in the hot tub, straight to dry yourself off in the, the where the waste, wastewater waste, can waste go waste away. Goes, yeah. Yeah. Like a wet room. Wet room, wet room. Good, Good idea. idea. Without wet a room. shower, because obviously that would obviously involve planning as well. Yeah, not going that way. So you could just access it from outside. If you're in the garden and you've got a bucket of water you want to throw away, this could work. Yeah. Okay. I think you can legally have. Yeah. Um, a place to wash your dog outside, can't you, without planning? So is that, got, a, do is that a dog? That? Oh yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Yeah. So, you got, so you're building, dog a, you're building a dog, dog, wash. Dog, dog wash. Dog wash on the front. Wash. Yeah. Dog yeah. wash. Yeah. Perfect. Dog rough, dog wash. And is there going to be an access point for a pipe going down? So people, if there's people in their motorhomes, you never know, to, to empty their toilet oh, cassettes. There's, there's that's, you know. that's a good idea. Like an Elson point. Elson point. Now yeah. that's something we Just could a thought. Yeah, yeah. Just a thought. Almost turns it into a campsite. Latest update from John. Right, sorry. Don't, jo don't ask me anything. I'm out the sun, avoiding heat stroke. Okay. I'm in the sun, getting heat stroke. Okay. How far have we got now? Two hours later. We've got some wood in place. We've got some supports in place. We're digging holes to put more supports in place. We're getting a good substructure. Substructure, yeah. Foundation. Foundation is everything, along with debate. Okay. We're just having a debate again now. Um, you want to know how long it is, John? So we want to know how far it is from there to there, is that what you're saying? Well, yeah, because we want to maximise our wood. We don't want to go too long and end up having a little cut of deck over if we could do it in a complete length. What do you think, Jim? I think he's got a point. I think our job is we're going to go to the field, we're going to measure the deck, we're going to come back, we're going to see what we need oh, awesome. lengthwise and we'll make it fit. Okay. If it's 4.8, that might like do too much. I don't like this work in the wood, it's chuffing no good, is it? Come on, field. I'll tell you what it does beat going out in the field. It's not quite like going, Steve, let's go down the other workshop. There we are, in the field. This is the field where the van normally is. Mm. Okay. So we have got two lengths. You take the measure again, because then you can see it. 4.8 and 3.6s. <laughs> How are you getting on your hole, Jimmy? I'm getting all right. It's, it's uh, leveling. Definitely self leveling. One day, this self will get used to leveling. But I still don't think I like woodwork. So, we're another hour into it. I wonder where the boys have gone. 
Not here. Oh. Hello. Busy? You? Busy? Pro proper job, Steve. Proper job. Gotta keep the energy up. Thank you, Auntie Tracy. So you've got a technical problem with something, have you, John? Yeah, the shed's in the way. Yeah. Right. We can't quite get a square. Okay, so what are you doing now? Well, I'm gonna hold it apart with my legs here. Okay. Because that seems safe. And okay. I've got an eye lift jack. Yeah. Which is a bit of a tool to use for extruding Land okay. Rovers and such things from All the right. mud. Oh, it's moving. Or just general butchery. Or general just moving things out of the way. Wonderful things, oil lift jacks, but they are dangerous as hell. Oil lift jacks. Hit the switch over, and it starts coming down with a vehicle on it. That handle then starts flashing up and down at a very fast rate of knots. And they are a bit dangerous, but they do work. Oil lift jack, ideal for shed removal. High lift or widespread. Widespread. Good job the. The timber was a little bit moist, that it moved really easy. Lubrication. I'm switching the camera off. Hello, boys. There's a bit of inspection. Are well, we getting somewhere now? So what we're doing here is just dug it out, take the top soil off. And now just compacting some sand down in, just to give the breeze blocks a nice solid base to get the height. So we chop the breeze blocks down, jump it down quite. And that's off jockey wood. He wants to go down a little bit further. I don't know, he's not looking too bad, is he? Blind man and his deaf dog will be pleased to see that one. So, yeah, that's that one in. Move to the next one. Well, some of us have been out for a haircut. Hope you like this. These boys have been here. Have a look. And they've okay, done well. Well, some people have been to the salon, the salon. to see their stylist. Brazilian, I heard. I heard, <laughs> I've heard he's had a full, full Jamaican. Yeah. Not quite sure what it is, and I don't want to look either. That must be why he's gone so long. Yeah. Like shearing a sheep. Yeah. <laughs> but we're getting there. We've been dodging the rain, the sleet, the snow, thunder, lightning. But I still decided, don't like wood. No chuffing good. But we're getting there. And the little noggin's going in. Nog the noggin. Right tools for the right job. <laughs> Oops. Morning, Steve. Day two, Jim. Day two, yeah. It's coming on. Um, we've all got just disconnecting some electrics for the next Oops. section. Looking good, boy. It's looking good. Um, we need to go and get some more 4x2 or 2x4, whatever we want to call it. I so, noticed yesterday when I was looking at these clips, there's a lot of times you said, I don't like wood. I still don't like wood. <laughs> it's no chuffing good, as they say. Can't weld it back together, can you? We're not going down near the workshop. We're going down the bonfire by the workshop. so bad. Get the hang of it. So we're getting there.
peoples, Dog Rough Engineering has got into woodwork. Um, what can I say? Um, Looking good, boy. Bloody hard weekend, but yeah, I think we've done all right, don't you? I think you've done very well, boy. Yeah, I, I think we've done all right. So, just remember, guys, um, well straight, click and subscribe, press the buttons. Cheers, guys. Happy Easter. I'm really chuffed, I am. Yeah, it's doing good. Let's see what happens. Let me get some fuel through. 